Good evening, good evening, good evening. Welcome to Absolute Word Ministry Black History Month 2020 celebration. We are continuing our Black History Month celebration. Uh, let's see, I just want to make sure I have everything correct here. Okay, and let's see here. All right, so let's get started. Let's get started. Tonight, we are going to talk some um, from our history. The first young lady we will be discussing is the Queen of Zaria, Nigeria, from the 15th century. All right. Aminatu, commonly known as Amina, was a great Hausa warrior who later became the queen of Zaza Zazau, apparently known as Zaria. As a granddaughter to King Sarkin, Amina was the apparent heir of the throne after Bakwa of Tarunku, the king's wife and the mother of Amina. Contrary to how her mother used to rule the Zakuo kingdom, Amina chose to be a warrior and eventually became one of the greatest warriors of the Zazao kingdom. And when her mother died, the kingdom was passed to Karma, the queen's younger brother who ruled for 10 years. Amina, after Karma's death, then became the queen of Zazao. She ruled for 34 years and continued to be an active warrior until her death. History has it that she conducted her first military expedition three months after she stepped into power. This, in turn, helped her to hold her power into place for another 34 years, which again saw her expand the, Zaz the Zau kingdom into one of the greatest domains of that time. We honor you, we honor you, Queen Amina, this day in history, celebrating our Black History Month 2020. And the next powerful woman we'll be talking about tonight is Queen Candace, the Empress of Ethiopia. She was the Empress of Ethiopia in 332 BC. In a bid to conquer the formidable ancient Egyptian kingdom, Alexander had to first invade Ethiopia in 332 BC, but his army could not go past Ethiopia since it was being commanded by one of the most dreaded generals of that time, Empress Candace. King Alexander, on seeing this, decided to pull his pull back his army as he could not risk being defeated by this great African empress. And to this and up to date, historically, Candace is credited as one of the strongest female military tactician who also had great military commanding skills. Today, we honor you, Queen Empress Candace, in history, celebrating our Black History Month 2020. I encourage each and every one of you to check the stories out on these powerful women. You can visit AnswerAfrica.com, A-N-S-W-E-R, Africa.com, answerafrica.com. I tell you, these stories are, they are just so powerful and to be learning so much about our ancestors and what uh, African-American people have accomplished over the years, over the years that, you know, we, we, we did not just we weren't just created back in 1950 or 1960. No, we have been here for the long haul. 
Can you hear me? We have been here for the long haul. So I thank you and I encourage each and every one of you to continue to do your own research um, to learn more and to help your, if you have young people or if you know of young people, to help them learn more about their ancestors and the things that African Americans have contributed to the world as we know it, okay? Thank you, and I look forward to chit-chatting with you tomorrow evening as we continue on with our Black History Month celebration. Have a wonderful evening.